Hi Aries, welcome to my channel and this is your reading for the next four months. It's the end of a year, September, October, November and December. It's a general reading, so take as is resonate and leave the rest. Let's get started with September. Quick message for Aries. Okay, this is cut. Yeah. The month of September, Aries, I can see a confrontation. Someone is very jealous, working against you. Okay. We have two cards here. Soros and the X. Stay positive at this time. Let's see your animal spirit for the month of September, Aries. This combination is just telling me there is a false person around you. Surround yourself from positivity areas. Let's see. We have the spider showing up. Make your dreams real. It's you creating something. You have a plan. It's about a business. It's like a construction. It's going to take time. Be patient with yourself areas. Let's see, what do you need to focus next month? For some of you, you are feeling ghosted by a fire sign, maybe a Leo. So best you can do is to take action, to chill this situation. This energy is about feeling lost. You don't know what to do. Okay. It's like you are very patient with this person, but I really feel like you need to change your mind. Stop waiting for this person. There he is. Let's see. Something is going to end. I feel like it's the end of a relationship. With the Ten of Swords showing up, it's because it's, it was a lack of communication, worry, stress, and anxiety. Areas. Let's see. I see you free making a decision here. It's like you have your power back and you need to face in your fear next month. And see just three cards for the month of September for areas. What do we have? Confirmation with an ending here. We have the Ten of Swords showing up again. Situation is going to end. You are really focused on your career. You are also a little bit defensive, protecting your hurt. You don't want to get hurt again. Time for you to heal next month's areas, okay? with Aquarius energy, a lot of healing energy. One is a ten of swords for Aries. Let's see. It's a ten of swords. We have the eight of swords. It's going to end because you've been feeling stuck about this situation for a long time. It's time for you to free yourself, Aries. With the Queen of Swords, it's using your mind. It's like the situation wasn't fair. Someone was doing something behind your back. Stress and preoccupation on your mind. Areas. It's why you need to heal from this situation. With the Nine of Pentacles, it's a very positive energy. You're going to be more confident. 
you are single, alone, but time for you to take care of yourself. Okay. About your finances, everything will be okay. I really feel like it's about your love life. So there is something a little bit challenging here. If you are single, it's the end of a job situation. It's because you, you deserve so much better. Let's see. It's the end of a relationship, it's telling me. Too much incertitude here, secrets. You've been feeling very confused about this connection, areas. And for you to be in control, okay? Stop waiting for this person to come back. Let's see. So month of October, what do we have for you, Aries? October for areas. Okay. Don't lower your standard. Okay. It's like a red flag showing up. Don't for you to see the true areas. We have the gong, an exciting event. You're going to celebrate something in October. Opportunity is on your way. With a carrot, I feel like it's yes, business opportunity, something about money, okay. Let's see. Your energy in October areas. So you're working really hard. You need to collaborate. You're really focused on your career here. This month is going to be very busy. What do you need to focus in October areas? Focus on collaboration, the same energy is showing up. So three of pentacles, it's about working in family. You can be talking about a project, something creative. It's like you need some help, you need to collaborate in October. It's a confirmation, the same energy. It's also telling me that it's a new project, something new here. With a number one showing up. Opportunity to meet someone new, areas in October, a new love offer. And I can see a challenge here. You're going to overcome the situation. Achievement. Very good combination here. Let's see, just three cards for October. Message for areas. What do we have for you, Aries? Definitely it's about your job. You can see it's you mastering your skills. Your boss is watching you. You can be proud of yourself. It's focus and determination about your career. Something unexpected is coming for you in October. It's like success and victory, clarity about the situation. Aries. What's going on with the Eight of Pentacles? 
success is on your way you can see I feel like with the tower showing up and the king of wands again it is definitely a situation is not working anymore you're going to reveal something more stable with better foundation for some of you this combination is talking about is there is a new love offer maybe it's a Leo or a fire sign coming for you someone very attractive I feel like with the eight of pentacles what do we have for areas the eight of pentacles so you're very busy doing a lot of things at the same time okay something unexpected is coming for you with the tower let's see we have the seven of thoughts it's you defending yourself about the situation because you don't want to fight anymore. You are defensive here. And with the Ace of Swords, clarity about the situation. Ooh. We have the Knight of Cups, confirmation about a new love offer. Okay. Despite this cancer, Scorpio energy, someone romantic coming in your life areas. Let's see. About your job. So you're creating stability for you and for your family. Something is not working anymore, okay? Just for some of you, this person from your past wants to come back, but you're not interested, okay? The fight is over. It was a very painful ending, and there is someone new here around you. New opportunity is coming for you. Let's see. Let's go ahead and learn about this new opportunity. For some of you, it's a colleague of yours. Okay. You are working with this person, someone very intelligent. Let's see. It's a month of November. A message for Aries. What's going on for Aries for November? We have the fox showing up. The fox represents you very intelligent. It's resourcefulness, especially in business. Just be aware, can be talking about a situation too good to be true, or there is someone manipulative around you. I really feel like it's about your job. We have the fox showing up again here. Let's see what's going on. Message. We have money showing up. About your money, your finances, everything will be okay. Can be talking about a promotion is telling me, okay? We've been feeling confused about your job, but it's going to pay off in November. You are working really hard for the month of October. Money is on your way here. Let's see. Message. Clarity about the situation, truth, transcends, illusion, no more confusion in your mind. What do you need to focus for the month of November, Aries?
we have the five of pentacles. I feel like you've been feeling stuck about your finances. There is a change on your way areas, okay? An opportunity is coming here. Message for areas. I'm sorry. <sighs> Message for areas. Okay, we have the dove. It's peace, serenity. It's about destiny, areas. Let's see, just three cards. Quick message for areas for the month of November. Can be talking about also a new job offer. You are facing your fear, your shell, your ego at this time. Success is coming for you because you can see you are creating your own abundance here. It's going to pay off. You've been working really hard, Aries. The five of wands, it's an inner conflict. Just relax, everything will be okay, Aries. Let's see. Why is the six of wands? The six of wands, we have the four of pentacles. You are taking care of your money because you have planned for the future areas. You are taking a risk here. The sun is coming. The sun represents abundance coming for you after a painful ending, a challenging situation, okay? It's a positive outcome in November areas. Let's see your last message. Confusion, stress about finances. Some good news are coming for you. A new contract, you're going to sign an important document with the sun again here. It's a new light, hope in your life. Very good combination. It's the month of December, Aries. Let's see. A message for areas. A secret art mirror. Someone is going to help you with a big shine up. I see you very innocent and kind. Okay. For some of you, you have children around you. You need to know that you're a very good mother. Let's see. Your animal spirit for the month of December. With this card, can be talking about a partnership, a proposal for some of you, collaboration with someone. Got the koala spirit. So koala, it's about slow movement, but it's you also very intuitive, loving and caring areas. Your focus for December, a 
Richard is coming. It's about Pasha. Let's see. Someone see you very attractive areas. You have your power back, it's your energy as a queen of wands. You are both assertive, confident. Very good energy areas. For some of you, you're dealing with someone younger of you. We have the dolphin. It's about happiness, playfulness. I see you having fun with someone. It's also talking about collaboration, cooperation, okay? Equal give and take in relationship. Message for Aries. You're going to celebrate some of with your family in December. It's also important for you to rest. For some of you, you're going to go on vacation. Let's see. There is a lot about love you don't see coming. You are too focused about your past, about what you lost. Someone very attractive is coming for you with the king of wands. A fire sign, maybe. With the two of swords, you're going to make a difficult choice. It's like a crossword in your life. Time for you to see the truth. You are making the best decision for yourself. Let's see what's going on about this new offer. It's a brand new offer. Okay, it's like a past life connection. This new connection is going to be magic, Aries. Something new and stable is on your way. If you're not interested about love, it's a new job offer. Or a bonus. Something long term. With the King of Wands here, we have the Three of Cups. You're going to miss this person because of your friends or during a celebration. Aries. With the Two of Swords, we have the Four of Swords also. Very important for you to heal from your past, okay? You can see we have the queen and the king of wands. It's like your perfect match. And it's a lot of fire and sexual attraction between you two. We like this person was watching you for a long time. Bashup showing up here with a whip. Can you take in about a long distance relationship or this person needs to travel to be with you? Or you're going to meet this person during a trip? Okay. It's a bright new opportunity. Aries with a kick out. Aries, this is your reading. Thank you so much for watching and being here. Take care. Bye.